there and welcome to another Dave Does. Today we are checking out Cobra and the Lotus and the song Light Me Up. I've been looking forward to doing this one for quite a while. It was requested way, way back in July 2020. We're now in February of 2021. So it's taken me six months or so, uh, a little bit longer to get to this. I'm sorry about that. It uh, When I do get requests, I add them to my watch later list. My watch later list is usually up to up to 100 videos for video reactions. Uh, and I only tend to do about six at a time when I'm recording them. So if you can imagine there's only one video a day on average I upload, uh, sometimes more if I've got a lot of backlog, um, you can imagine how long it takes me to get through some of these lists. But yes, we're there. We'll check out Cobra and the Lotus. Uh, now, if you like this video, please do subscribe, click the like on like and share. There'll be no pausing or talking during the video, so I'll share the thoughts and feelings at the end. You can enjoy the song. I can enjoy the song without interruption. Uh, and some blurbs will come across the screen around supporting the channel. Let's count it in. Three, two, one. Go!
Okay, Cobra and the Lotus and Light Me Up, powerful uh, song, great message, uh, or not great message, but a powerful message, I should say. Uh, and I always, I, I was having a quick look at the uh, some of the information about the band. So obviously, Canadian band, uh, and this song came off of Prevail One. Uh, so they formed in 2009. This came out in 2017. Uh, Cobra Page, obviously, it's 2019, has built the band around her uh, over the time. Uh, vocals apparently have changed since her when she started. I think her vocals sound great, so I'm intrigued to know what the earlier stuff sounded like. Uh, but this sounds, I mean, she, she's got a great, powerful voice. It kind of um, don't always like doing comparisons because they're never they're never 100 accurate, but. I kind of, if I was, you know, when you like try and put like a ladder of bands and you kind of go, well, where do they sit? So if you liked these bands, would they sit in there? There's mention of bands like Epica and I'm, like, I'm kind of like Epica. Yeah, I kind of get, but I'm actually kind of feeling more like if you were, if you were to kind of get, take some of Amaranth and take some of Within Temptation and it's kind of in that kind of ballpark for me rather than the Epica. The Epica is going more towards the Nightwish. This doesn't have that Nightwish vibe. It doesn't have that big synth thing. This this is more rock heavy or hard rock uh, rather than symphonic metal, which is where the Epica and the others, even with like Within Temptation, I don't think they go into the symphonic metal as much as uh, like the Epicas and that sort of bands go into. So yeah, these these guys or ladies and gents uh, band, whatever you want to call it, however you want to refer to them, uh, kind of sit comfortably in that for me. Uh, obviously others will have other viewpoints on it. Uh, song itself, great song, really nicely produced, lots of power in there, uh, good overall production, love to voice as I said, uh, the solos sounded nice and sharp and clean, uh, in tone anyway. Uh, not necessarily from a, a distortion point of view. It's not going to be uh, like a clean guitar, as I say. A uh, couple of I like sometimes with the way of with the videos with like uh, with the Napalm records. They always put a couple of other snippets of other songs. You get to an idea then if by hearing this one song how similar the next ones are. And there was some good variety in there. Uh, the last two on there, which was uh, you don't know. Obviously, the second one was a different band than the Messiah which I did think was a bit odd. Uh, I'd have liked maybe two Cobra and the Lotus, but the second Cobra and the Lotus one that you don't know does sound quite similar to this last one we've just reacted to, Light Me Up. Um, so we kind of know that we're in the same sort of ballpark, if you like, of what the style is. It's not just a one-off in sounding like a very commercial and then again to go off and do death metal or something else. Very odd. Um, I am completely rambling right now. There you go, just filling up airspace for you. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to check them out again. I'm going to do some more on these because I really liked that song. I thought it was very, very cool. Now let me know what you think in the comments down below. If you like the video, please do subscribe, click the bell icon, like, share. Let me know of other bands or our songs you'd like me to check out and I will endeavour to do so. It may take me up to six months, but I'm, I will try and get there. Uh, thank you very much for watching and that, of course, is how Dave does it.